Hello, I'm Darker of AT, and welcome to a game called Ghost Story. This is a visual novel game that is found on Itch.io. I had to think about that. I don't know. I just got I just got I got given a link to this game. So, if if the game's terrible, don't blame me because I wasn't the one who found it. <laughs> but yeah, so this is this is a game that you play in browser, and we I don't know much about it. There wasn't really much of a description, but Ghost Story, right? It's going to be about ghosts and stuff, right? <laughs> so we're now looking at some sort of weirdy, really weird kind of what chicken person? It looks like a weird chicken person. I assume we just click on the chicken to begin. Chicken with really long human legs. They come to us without a word. I click on word, okay. They noticed a difference after a few months. Something had changed, not only themselves, but also the world around them was different. The wind swept briskly beneath the door cracks and, and time, days, weeks, months had become denser. Sometimes the silence in the apartment was unbearable. It was like a vacuum they lived in, but also outside, among people, on on, on lively shopping streets, they found no escape. It was as if the others looked right through them. They wanted to get noticed, to shout at them, but they could not make a sound. Okay. <laughs> Got lots of weird chicken people. Alright, are these meant to be like weird ghosts or something? <laughs> Both felt the same way, but they did not tell each other about it. Their feelings weren't within their reach, and they just couldn't articulate it What? It quite right. They could only feel the strange silence. Alright. So a door has opened. Thoughts that do not go away and cannot be thought away any more. Something that changed forever, it can slowly be soft footed. In the beginning there were occasional thoughts which could easily be discarded, but then they settled and showed up starting from the early morning just after waking up, and the more one wants to banish them, the stronger they get. They always go away just for a short time, maybe while one is reading a book or looking through the window, but then suddenly come to the surface without power or warning. We are haunted. There is one, only one short, short rest. Then it goes to the next round. They heard noises under their bed. They could see them from the corner of their eye. But it, but if they looked directly, there was nothing to see. They, they couldn't decide what was better, what, what was the better thing to do. Ignore them and try not to listen or approach them. Speak to them. Okay. We are haunted. The rooms are haunted. Okay. <laughs> they begin to keep watch during the night. Inside they knew that it would not help. But they had the feeling that someone had to stay awake all the time. Maybe out of fear, maybe to merely create the appearance of control. The night stayed quiet after some time. They nearly thought it was all... was just their imagin- <laughs> The night stayed quiet and after some time they nearly thought it all was just their imagination. Until one night- This, this, this is really weirdly worded. Like it doesn't quite flow. It's a bit- it's really bitty. <laughs> Until one night. Maybe just me reading. I don't know. There was a strange glow under the bed. She shouted. But no one answered. Slowly, unwillingly, she stepped into the edge of the bed and tried to look under it. Okay. I have no idea what's going on either, by the way. <laughs> Why don't you leave me? I cannot do it. No, 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 no. What? Not human. Stop. Or well, spa. We need to go to the spa first and then stop. Um. Aggie! Aggie! <laughs> Alright. 
I lead the door. I, I, I lead the door. What? <laughs> I led a double life. I saw him lying underneath with a pocket flashlight in his hand. In the in the night, while I was sleeping, with his back turned to me, his torch blinds me. In the night, I'm I am dazzling. <laughs> someone else. I saw his back. He talks to someone else. I pulled myself up again. Again, August for who? What's he talking to? Breathe, but be quiet. Breathing quietly. Okay. Is someone with three heads? Two heads? One head? Two heads? No heads? Three heads? Unless if oh, if I don't upside down, yeah, then 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 like that the weird chicken legs are actually like weird ears, and they have like aren't they three balls or maybe just some udders or something? Don't know. My chicken nuggets are a bit weird. I didn't plain to McDonald's. Uh, took a hot bath, so hot that it was just bearable. Dove in. Free with her head, wanted to forget everything, just stick sink to for the. F foam five time went by as came out of the water six all sorrows seven and felt light and unburdened until eight gaze one <laughs> wanted to the ceiling nine ten eleven twelve thirteen What we've got some sort of weird hole in the ceiling now. All right. Seemed to be further further away than normal. The paint had, which had spread all over the. Can I just like type something here? I feel like. I can type stuff. There seems to be spaces. The paint had, which had spread all over the walls. Left the tub, and wrapped, a fresh towel around. When. I definitely feel like I should be, should be able to type some stuff in here. Surely, no? No? Why is there weird gaps everywhere? Went through the apartment on wet feet. The water from hair trickled onto the wooden floor. In the door frame was a notch which had had never seen before, as well as another hole in the wall behind the dark. Couldn't understand how they could have overlooked this the whole time. What the hell is going on? Is there something? Oh no! Oh no! I can I I I can highlight stuff. I just can't. What does it say here? Painted had. Oh, had cracks. Okay. Oh my god. What does it say here? The ceiling. The ceiling seemed to be further away than. Oh my god! Do I have to really do this? Which, who again? Is there anything here? No. Okay. Who? Not. Who? Not me. Couldn't understand how they could have overlooked this whole time. Oh my god! What? Why are there word and word that are just missing or just painted in black? It makes no sense. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. One time they sat side by side on the couch watching TV. Both had been very quiet the whole day. They watched in silence while eating the warmed-up meal from yesterday. Suddenly, who? Suddenly, who? Paused, stopped the movement. The fork still in the air, and said, pondering, still looking to the TV. Some, sometimes one forgot to do. Sometimes one forgot the others are real human beings, have their own thoughts and a whole world inside themselves. Sometimes one has to remember that, so as not to forget. The wise words of who said, "Uh, who?" Turned around to who, <laughs> and looked at whom. 
<laughs> ah. uh, with a strange, eerie look. I'm guessing who? Who got goosebumps? <gasps> then who turned back to the TV? And they both resumed eating and did not talk anymore. One day, and it was the last, she had a bad feeling in her stomach. The feeling had set in her stomach and everywhere else she couldn't... <laughs> oh, and she couldn't shake it off. Her contact lenses itched in her eyes and her eyes itched properly and her sight was blurred. She had to blink all the time. The feeling as if she might had put them in the wrong eyes. Is that a thing? I don't wear one contact lenses. Do you have like a left eye and a right eye? I don't know. The right one, okay, in the left and the left in the right. Okay, fair enough. For a short moment, she had to think about where there was left and where there was, that there was right. After she remembered, she stood still for a moment and raised her dominant arm, the right one. She felt a bit stupid. She shook her head and proceeded walking in a fast pace. Shook her head with her arm raised up like this. Yeah, I feel a bit stupid too. <laughs> as long as she behaved normally, everything would be normal as well. <laughs> That's normal. Uh, I really am weird, aren't I? I don't do that. <laughs> Why she continued walking, she noticed she had become lost. That was strange, because she always took this route. Despite that, the streets and the area was unfamiliar. She had also started to sweat and then to shiver because of the cold. Cold sweat, so oh no, she's coming down with a fever. And then she was hit with full force by someone looking out of a window. Dot 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 oh my god seriously dot 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 a lot of part time has passed here oh she couldn't face she couldn't she couldn't see the faces of the people on the streets anymore they had become indistinct and blurred indefinable grey lumps she felt ill and dizzy. She had no hold on to the. She had to hold. That was my fault. She had to hold on to the railing so as not to fall down. But then she flinched, because she couldn't recon recognize the railing anymore. She knew it was there. She knew it. It was a dark green railing, but she couldn't see it. There were just parallel rods, but they didn't serve a purpose were made by nobody were just no sense this game is no sense it's not even a game it's just a random story <laughs> interactive novel i guess not really much interaction it's just clicking on random words as she looked up there was no house anymore all right the house were not houses the houses were not houses she could glance through and could only see the pieces the at homes but not the house as the whole anymore. As a whole anymore. The house was just there. And... And, 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 and amorphous, amorphous figure, which had been people one time but not anymore, were walking in and out. Also, the rest of the city consisted of a times. Sometimes she stumbled upon them or bumped against them. But she didn't know what it was or had been, and she made her way forward, struggling through the the entanglement of observed, observed quirks. Quirks? Quirks. Uh. She she didn't want to, to look at herself. She was scared that she was was a purposeless being herself. A an unspeakable horror crept over her. Her senses were numb, or maybe she she could now see much more than before. All right. 
as if everything was unveiled around her, everything was vacant, even a bit absurd. For example, this street sign or whatever it was, she couldn't even decide, decipher. It was so ridiculous she could only stand before it and laugh hysterically. She walked on and so soon felt ill again because she thought about the sign. And the sign was there after all humans were dead. And it would mean nothing like herself. Even she was a sign. Simply there. Just being a sign. <laughs> oh. Okay, that that was all crossed out. They, they, they didn't like that. But maybe she wasn't, and had never been, and had only disguised herself among all other signs. Maybe. Oh, the plot thickens. At one time, everything went the wrong direction. So her left contact went into her right contact, and her right right contact went into her left contact. But if they were the wrong way, in, if they went the wrong direction in the first place, then now they're going in the right direction. But we didn't know whether we could have changed something. Maybe there had been places, places we shouldn't have been to, people we shouldn't have talked to, thoughts we shouldn't have thought. Things we shouldn't have eaten, food we shouldn't have food in. It doesn't really quite work, does it? But it was too late for, for a long time now. And the events had grown their own consciousness and didn't want to return to their old places. The end. It is never the end. What happened? I don't understand what happened. There was a lot of who's and whom's and and but we couldn't see those. They, they were the ghosts. We couldn't see them on the page. And then there was green green railings and then there were signs and then she thought she was a sign. Like a stop sign, like a bus stop sign or 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 or, or, or a turn left or turn right sign. Or signs saying this is this is my left eye, this is my right eye. Or then there were steps and houses, but they weren't houses. People weren't there anymore. The houses that that were houses were no longer houses. Forts that were forts were no longer forts. People that were people were no longer people. What has this world become? This is the scariest horror story I've ever read. And I don't want to. Ugh. Oh, okay. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to explain to me what happened in the conversation below, then please do. <laughs> Cheerio. <laughs> Ugh. Cheerio.